I met President Bush about 10 years ago. First day on the job, and um, it, it was an amazing thing. Ed Beckett was helping out at his friend's shop in Kennebunkport when the town's most famous summer resident walked in to get his hair cut. Over the last decade, Ed formed a connection with George H.W. Bush. The former president followed Ed when he opened up his own barber shop here in Kennebunk. It was special just to be able to be with him, you know, and be around him and be in his presence and talk to him over the course of the years. And that was, that was definitely the most special thing. Ed tells us Bush 41 had a way of commanding the room. Saying hi to the kids and shaking hands with everyone that comes through. And when it got too tough for President Bush to come down here to the shop in Kennebunk, that's when Ed would start making house calls to Walker's Point. I gave uh, Sully his first pig ear. He was carrying those things around. He wouldn't let them go until they were gone. But you know, it's like a crunchy potato chip for a dog. It's like, how do you beat it? During haircuts, Ed and HW would talk about a lot of things, but not politics. To be able to relate, we usually were hitting up on the good stuff like the stripers and where they were running and stuff like that. Now that President Bush has passed away, Ed says he finds peace in the thought that 41 is now reunited with his wife of 73 years. It was a bittersweet thing. I was initially sad and then the more I thought about it, I said that's the only place he really would want to be, I, I could imagine right now. So I'm happy for him to be with her for sure. In Kennebunk, Paul Merrill, WMTW News 8.